Drag Week is one of our favorite events. Thousand mile road trip, five days of racing. We're gonna show you one of our favorite cars from Drag Week 2017. Every year at the end of the year, we end up with footage we haven't had a chance to get to, but we couldn't miss this one. Check it out. Well, we got a big turbo attached to a little car here. What, what exactly is this? It's a Triumph TR6, 1969. I built my own tube chassis. I had a couple of my buddies help me out a lot. And then uh, stretched out the wheelbase 14 inches, uh, put a big Pontiac motor. Family heirloom, my mom and dad drove that 1970 400 block up the driveway back in 1970. So family heirloom, stroker crank, so it's a 488 and a 91 millimeter turbo. Jeez, that's that just screams I like to party. Yeah, 4L80 tranny lockup converter. Drives down the freeway 70 miles an hour, two grand. Wow. A little loud, maybe. Yeah, I'm sure it is. <laughs> but uh, you bet get a lot of looks too, don't you? Oh yeah, it's been fun. I turbocharged this thing back in 2005, kind of back in the dark ages. So it's still. Wow. I'm still uh, eight years on that short block. I'm just about ready to finally put a motor in it. The car is finally ready for more power again, so it took forever. Well, good deal. You're going to give it one last hurrah here at Drag Week? Well, we're going to try and run a high eight at every pa every track. We can do it. You know, it's hard to say if it'll make it or not. But Well, good deal. This will be the, the test of it this week, huh? Right. Well, it, it fin I finished in 13 and 12. I had gone 36 hours with no sleep, so I gave up because it just oh my started God. to get dangerous. I was just so tired it was dangerous. So the well, car was still good to go. All I needed was a couple wheel studs, and I could have kept going, but uh, I was just I couldn't do it. I hear you. You got no one to quit, right? Oh yeah, sometimes it's a good idea. By the end of five days of drag week, 16 hours of sleep in five days, you know, that's kind of typical. Yeah, it it's, is. Yeah, drag week is just crazy. I don't it even is. know why people would do this. <laughs> but here you are. <laughs> here I am. It's a challenge of uh, uh, man and machine, and this is my science project. Well, you got quite the project. And they call you Fast Eddie? Oh, they do call me that. One of my buddies just put on the internet here the other day, Captain Insano. Oh, I told the my wife said to get a haircut. I says, no, nah, I'm dying it green. Attaboy. <laughs> Attaboy. So what's this car weigh? It's about 3,000 with me in it. It's pretty heavy. You know, it's a turbo car. It's a DOM tubing car. You know, okay. so it's good metal. You know, it's like 10, 20 carbon steel, so it's strong. So it makes it a little heavy. And then I got two by three frame rails. The car's been pounded up and down the road since, I think I first got it on the road about 2003 with a nitrous uh, iron-headed Pontiac motor. Oh, dang. And it ran, it, I did get that one to go 999 at one point, but it would run low tens basically on the street. That's what I built this for years ago, you know. That's... Basically, you'd, you'd hit it, it would stay stuck, you'd get it to about walking speed, put it on a buck 25 shot, and it would stay stuck out on the road. It was, people hated it, and then it was a, seven colored Frankenstein because of the doors I added eight inches here moved the rear wheel openings back six inches and stretched the wheelbase 14 I think I said that this thing's nuts like you said this is a science project and it's it's yeah. badass it's been running good I mean it, I keep checking it and the welds don't break I thankfully I got some buddies that helped me I built I put all the parts together and then had somebody to do what they're doing, do my tag in and my final welding. Smart. That's all you can ask for, really. Yep. I can't wait to see this thing hit the track. Oh, yes, it, 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 it runs 880s. It's boring to look at. I built it like a pro stocker back here, so it, if it picks the wheels that high, that's a big wheelie for this thing. Wow. You know, but it doesn't even look like it's fast. It just kind of drives off the starting line. Well, cool. Thank you. Should be a fun week, man. Oh, I'm hoping. Beautiful weather for a car with no windows. Somebody had to put the bars in the doors because he's too fat to fit in there otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> but well, it, it kind of cleans it up. I mean, it doesn't it even does. have to race it, other fish. It looks really good. Well, thanks for bringing it out, man. All right, thank you for stopping over and talking with me. Go get him, Fast Eddie. All right, thank you. Yeah.
800 slower than he wanted to go. He actually slowed down a couple hundred off of his last pass. What would you get on that one? What's that? 940. I don't know. It's quite, it slowed down quite a bit. Mile per hour was there. So huh. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't want to spin. So I really didn't build any. The, moves. the first run, run looked a little squirrely. Yeah, I saw you through the really shooter. Hard. Really. Yeah, I, with no boost at all, it only went a 160. So that's why it slowed oh, down. Oh yeah. I don't know if I have time there. to bring it around one more time and try yeah. one hard hit. How about a half hour? What do you I'll put it, bring up the boost to about seven pounds and see if it can stick it. Parachute's kind of nice. Went straight? Yeah, no kidding. Sucks in the heat back and at the hail, keep you straight. <laughs> Good luck.